November 14th, 2007. Dear Governor Schwarzenegger, I knew that California was the first state to end the ban on interracial marriage in 1948, and I always assumed that we would continue to be leaders and proponents for all civil rights for all people. Imagine my surprise when I discovered that California didn't add sexual orientation to its protected classes until 10 years after Wisconsin. We were also outscored by Massachusetts, Connecticut, and Hawaii before we passed our legislation in 1992. Likewise, with marriage equivalency, we were behind the ball. Even Hawaii had domestic partnerships before we did, way back in 1997. Vermont scored in 2000. Our domestic partnership is the same as marriage law, didn't go into, didn't slide into home base until 2005. Five years too late. On marriage, we were poised to take the lead when love went to bat in San Francisco in the spring of 2004, and when our legislature became the first to channel that human need from the people to the governor. But Massachusetts won the World Series of Civil Rights when they approved marriage and you struck us out. You've become not part of the first state to end the ban on same-sex marriage, but the first governor to unilaterally block the people's freedom to marry. I'm embarrassed that you took away our victory then and embarrassed that you refuse to stand on the side of freedom and equality now. Please stop telling your friends colleagues and neighbors that their relationships and their humanity is less important than yours and support the freedom to marry for everybody. Yours, 